though the body was not bigger big mm. expand mm. fat is fat is fat or fatter expanding but yet and the rope was going longer and longer but yet two angles fingers lace this is what one finger is that i will bind krishna i will control krishna i will take darshan of krishna i will have mercy of krishna and we are doing practices bhakti practices but very sudurlabh rare to bind krishna we cannot control krishna we cannot see krishna with our efforts and sadhan and bhajan but without also this we cannot do anything when the mercy of krishna will come and add with this when krishna will see that oh this person devotee is doing so much effort for me and he is now tired seeing his labor and all these thing he will be merciful then his mercy plus his practice both will do at a time and krishna can be seen we can have real bhakti otherwise not he will be controlled otherwise not so here jashoda was practicing a sadhak ji practicing to help the darshan of krishna but when krishna mercy will come to see that oh he is hungry he is doing so much austerities and he is striving for me he is so much suffering from for me like rup sanatan sankhya purvak nam gan nati bhi kala avasani kritau nidra har har vihar bijitau tatant dinau radha krishna gun smriti madhur me anandain sammohit like rup sanatan always weeping here and there not taking anything dry crumbs chickpeas No, no. Chickpeas, 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 eh? chickpeas. Chick 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 dry. Sometimes, sometimes never. Whole night waking, no sleep at all. Always weeping. Oh, Radhika, where you are? Oh, Lalita, where you are? Oh, Krishna, where you are? Be merciful. Always weeping. Eh? So when we see that. we became hopeless we cannot do like this so krishna will be so much merciful seeing these things one sanatan go swami was taking giving parikrama of govardhan he he has become now old it was so hot midday hot samadhi very hot all uh, whole Swell where boiling, boiling. Was doing pari, was doing pari, was doing parikrama. He could not be here. At one place, he became faint. Then Krishna and Baldam, Baldam both came, and Baldev did some shit from his. Close, close. What? Chadar. And Krishna put his very soft and fragrant, sweet hand on the head of Sanatan Goswami. At once, he looked and saw that oh, beautiful Krishna and Baldev are there, and he began to weep. Krishna told, "Oh, Sanatan, I cannot bear this. That in these old days." and you are doing parikrama in very hot day daily hmm? i cannot be here so i am giving you this little shila with my footprint and cows footprints and with bansi and take it and do parikrama only this you will have the fruit of doing parikrama to all govardhan so if you are trying so much you have, you have observed in bhakti in such a way 
that you have forget when to take eat or when to sleep everything you are forget and you can give up anything for krishna and then you will be akhil krishna krishnarthe akhil chesta parayan and krishnarthe akhil bhog atyar when we will be detached from worldly all these thing and do anything for the benefit of krishna then krishna may come otherwise not so both thing be there or practices what rup goswami and other goswami has showed and also the mercy both because only sadhan will not do and only mercy will not do like krishna has mercy you have fallen down on a well in a well anyone is giving rope that you should take it and i will pull you out pull you out but he is not catch hold that rope hmm. not catching the soul that she will not come so this rope is krishna mercy and to catch hold is our practice both should be there chaitanya mahaprabhu has showed like this so both is needed only not that we are practicing and krishna is bound to give his darshan and give to his prem not not think like oh, now you should brave play <coughs> don't go so only two fingers he promised that i will bind krishna he has home why i should not bind i must bind sweats were coming face became something reddish. reddish and all the gopis were laughing and clapping you cannot bind jashoda began to pray his thakur ji o oh, thakur ji why i cannot bind my boy you should be merciful otherwise what my sakhis will laugh at you eh? they will laugh at you they will laugh so be merciful and he took shelter who was saligram oh. his one child was Sal- Sal- saligram is a part of a manifestation of krishna so became krishna became merciful at once kripa shakti came in his him kripa shakti is supreme shakti or power of krishna when there is no kripa shakti kripa shakti means kripa potency mercy potency mercy potency like basal or anything if it is not there then so much appliance is there but if these mercies are there then any devotee will let feel so much appliance in krishna and they will friendly serve krishna make happy and play with krishna in braj appliance always over the reference very far away especially when gopis will be there no appliance appliance will be hidden me so here when kripa shakti came in krishna he became merciful at once yog maya with appliance vanished from there and krishna was binded only by one bread rope, rope bread rope bread rope of jashoda <coughs> and he binded at once krishna became himself he was in binding कृपया आशीत स्व बंधने दृष्टवा परिश्रम कृष्ण कृपया आशीत स्व बंधने दिस मर्सी वॉज सो इन कृष्ण दैट ही बी कैम फुल ऑफ मर्सी एंड ऑल एपुलेंस एंड एवरीथिंग योग माया फाइन टू बी सो 
if you are trying like Jashoda and also offering himself yourself in the lotus feet of Krishna, Guru Dev, first to Guru Dev, and after that in the lotus feet of Krishna, then this rare bhakti may come and Krishna will be controlled. Otherwise not. So we should try to be like always chanting, remembering. There are in this world so many problems. Problems, problems, problems. From beginning of boyhood up to death. We should not be quietly upset in problems. to Remove the problems fully. We should think that what is the root of all the problems? What is the root of pro all problems? Forget Krishna. We have forgotten Krishna. So if this is solved, then all problems will quickly solve. And if you are engaged always in hundred and thousand and lakhs, lakhs, but to remove only problems. problems, more problems will come. More problems will come. So this is not process. <coughs> Very easy process to remind Krishna. <coughs> Who has made all these problems? <laughs> Who is the root cause? We ourselves. There is no anyone guilty for that. We should not make envy to anyone for these problems. You should note that we have done, made all problems. Anyone other is not responsible for that. We are only responsible, responsible. person for this. So don't try to hate anyone, to have any malice Malice. against them. And try to take shelter in the lotus feet of Krishna, always chanting, remember. And you will see that very quickly all problems will go. Hmm? Otherwise, never it will go by any worldly Arrangement. arrangements or any management. It will never go. So, all are telling me that this is my problem, this is my problem, this is my problem, this is my problem. Is my problem. But I know that only that root of all the problems is one that we have forgotten and we are not reminding, chanting, remembering and offering ourselves to the Lord of Krishna like Draupadi, like Shatabhama, like Rukmini, like Kunti, like Gopis. So we should try to follow them. And we should see that quickly all problems will go and Krishna will also be controlled. Hmm? When Krishna was controlled and Jasoda binded, she th thought that I binded back to, but actually Krishna was himself allowing her, bound, bind. uh, allowing her to bind. Uh, allowed himself to be bound. He was Comfort. himself. Came in bind. What? Came in bondage. What? He took the binding. Allowed himself to be not bound. allowed. He placed himself in bondage. Right. Himself he was accepted the binding. Hmm. He accepted binding. So we should try like that. Never be hopeless. Never. Like Jasoda never became hopeless. You should not be hopeless. You should not doubt in the power of Guru Dev, in the power of Krishna. In power of <coughs> Srimati Radhika, in the power of Bhakti, the silly persons making so much offenses in the lotus of Bhakti, they may have so much doubts. You should be always be careful of that associations where their doubts are. All these asra are calling very soundly that Sandhyatma Apinasyati. So don't be hopeless. 
doing only one day, two day, three day, four, five years. And even in hundreds and thousand life, if your bhakti is coming, it is very soon. So you should not be hopeless. Always be hopeful. That asha bandha samutkantha. That we will surely in this very lifetime, life, lifetime. we will realize bhakti and we will take darshan of Krishna. Otherwise, problems will come. Yasoda tightened Krishna very easily then. Uh, there are so much to explain, but I have no time because tomorrow we will go from here. There so I a, want to... In the afternoon there is a class tomorrow. Here? Yantakar Prabhu's house. Evening, evening, evening. But all will not go there perhaps. No, um, most, most, most all and they will leave evening. Oh. And some will spend night and next day you give some darshan. Okay. Not No class on Monday. And yeah. Only the individual local devotees yes. come for darshan. Very little, little. Pleasant meeting. Huh. So, I want to uh, speak, uh, speak something more. You can speak and then I will again. Try to do very brief. brief. <laughs> and he went to again charting. Charting. But now she was so unhappy, always remembering, weeping Krishna, weeping Krishna. And so by heart she was weeping, always. She could not churn, always observed in Krishna. In the meantime, when boys playing outside the door, waiting for Krishna, they saw that Jasuda has gone to churn. And they peep like this, and then they came laughing, joking, clapping, and telling Krishna like this, <laughs> what became? And they are clapping. When they were laughing, Krishna began to laugh, but sign of tears, with black tears, here and there, huh? was there. But Krishna, now, was playing with them, happy. They were laughing, he was also laughing. And they were cutting so many jokes. <laughs> then, they told that Krishna, may we untie this rope? Krishna, yeah, why not? Yes, <laughs> so first came Madhamangal, uh, oh. keeping all aside that I will do all very eager. Oh, I will do, I will do, I will do, but anyhow, Bil, um, Madhu Mangal, he kept all aside and he took the rope to untie, but he okay. could not untie. Then Subal Siddham all came one after another, one after another. but I thought, think that the rope may, became more and more. Okay. They were tightening, but not, not. Untightening. Hmm. Anyone could not tie. Untie. Hmm. How can it be untied? Dasya cannot untie the rope of Barsalya. Shakya cannot do. Only Barsalya, Barsalya can untie. Nandvaba can untie. Or Jasoda himself, herself. Anyone cannot. Or if Jasoda. Um, Srimati Radhika will come and he will look after that rope and it will be <laughs> he will have not to do anything. Oh, only oh, see rope and art ones. So they could not untie. Then they proposed that we should go out of home and we should play there. Sure. Krishna thought, oh, he remembered something. That is, so many long time before, Narada was going to Kailash. And at that time, 
Nara saw that the son of Kubeer, what name? Nal Kumar and Manikri Bear. We playing with naked girls in a pond. They have drunk so much. Drinking. Drink. Eh? They have drunk. Drunk so much wine. And he Jamlaju, and both were like trees. No shame, nothing. And Narad at once came. The path was nearby. Passing through. He was passing through. Sons, the two persons becoming so nirlajya, shameless. They wanted to play more and enjoy more. But all the girls become same shy. shy and they came out of water and took their cloths and folded their hands. They began to pray Narada Rishi from far away. But these two person, oh, mad in intoxication. intoxication, then never cared for Narad. And they were chastising all the girls to come at once. Why they are fearing from this old person, saintly person. and saintly person? He is like an wood, dry wood. So he was, they both were. What? Abusing, Abusing the girls. Narasa, that, oh, he is my friend's son. And also my friend Na uh, Shankar. And his associate is Kuber. I am very good turn with Kuber. But these sons, being the son of very good Bhakta, like Kuber, and so rich. But they have become so degraded. degraded. I should be merciful to him, them. He told that, oh, I should make you very good devotee, but not like this. I uh, operate to you, and I will take very forcibly your bad things. So I must operate. There are four things which are opposite for bhakti. And anyone cannot come if they are all engaged in four things. What are that? Dutam, Panam, Istriyam, Shuna, Jatra, Jatra, Chaturvida. And also a gold. Janma Swarja Suta Sivi A the Manapuna. What are that? Janma to be in a very astrocated family, to be very learned, to be very beautiful, whether male or female, and too much wealthy. If any was so beautiful, they cannot have belief in Krishna. They will want to control the whole world and lusty peoples. And they will gather all these things. They cannot go towards Krishna. Those who are so much uh, learned persons, oh, I am master of all. Hmm? All are giving praise to me. Why should I? Uh, Belief in God. God who is unreal. I cannot believe. Those who are wealthy. come from a respectable family. Who oh, I have told. Wealthy. And wealthy. If anyone is wealthy, <laughs> very, very blackish, very ugly. <laughs> Teeth are like this, <laughs> but yet he can collect so much <coughs> beautiful ladies by wealth. help of wealth. He can make servants all learned persons by wealth. 
we see in india so much wealthy uh, agrawal that in marwadi not learned only business men and they keep so many beautiful ladies their secretaries <coughs> Uh, writers and secretary, and so many learned persons, but of rusticated family, they make them servant and pay something, hmm? though they are ugly. So where is wealth? All fools are there. <coughs> so if these four are there, or any of them is there. then it is very hard come in bhakti line they have four this very rustic rusticated family like kubeer kubeer very rich he is world who is the most rich richest person in whole world forever and he is so learned they are all also learned but drinking merry doing merry and all these things forgetten krishna so i will take this human shape and i will make them tree and then they will always just standing in sun hot so much severe cold some will cut their hands and no water giving and thus they will realize so he <coughs> cost them that you should be tree then they began to weep oh we are son of your friend kubeer be merciful to us we are now going to be tree and I, we are realizing that we are becoming tree like tree sense is going on so be merciful then nar told that don't fear i will send you to braj there will be tree and new future krishna will come and he will be merciful and he will touch you and you will be liberated. again liberated liberated and you will be then associates of krishna so krishna remembered that my devotee, devotee narad. narad has promised this <laughs> i will have to fulfill that is why he went to court yeah. he was he was in a tendency that i should this time i should uh, what be merciful to them and we have to touch so that they should be liberated and they should be my associates so fulfill the desire of narad krishna tooking that mortar. mortar behind him and all boys were pulling pushing pushing at last they came at the door just in front of door there was two trees who were there malli boss son of nal kubar kubar nal kubar and manigri for thousand years and thousands year past they were so much now realizing that we have done so much bad things that norris has given a scorch like this krishna came he the tree was standing like this there was a very narrow passage pass krishna pass but grandal was mortar was stuck in this side and krishna was in that side. side krishna did not touch trees hmm? only the rope was tightened with mortar. connected with mortar and mortar was touched by tree tree so krishna mercy Power came through rope to Grendel, and from Grendel to mortar to trees. both yes. trees and trees at 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 once uprooted, uprooted and fell down. They don't. They did not came like this, like By this. Side. So Krishna was saved. All the boys who are falling, Krishna was saved, and it was very and dangerous sound, tremendous, tremendous sound. All brass became to set shape. Then Baba heard from Brahmand Ghat who was taking bath. Jasoda was churning, but not with mind and heart. 
she also heard all the Brajabashi heard all gathered there at once running towards Krishna. When Nanda Baba came, Krishna saw from a very big distance that why Baba is coming. Up till now he was clapping, he was so happy, he was Love. laughing with boys, but now when he saw his father, at once he remembered that Yasoda was frightened. frightened and he was trying to beat me. So he began to weep again. Again the, the river which was dried, again a current came, a flow came and he was doing like this. Nand Baba came, what is the matter? Who has binded you? Who has binded you? Krishna was weeping. Nanda Baba took Krishna in his lap and very easily, easily untied. untied the rope. And he gave from his pocket a laddu to Krishna. <coughs> Krishna took, but he could not take because he was so busy. So, so, so here Nanda Baba told that tell in my yes. ear who has done? Who has tightened you? Krishna is looking here and that whether his mother is near or not, he should not listen. He saw that mother is so far away and he has become like a statue. No life, nothing, not breathing even. If the trees has fallen on him, what happened? I cannot, so he was not even in life. He has become like a dry wood, a statue. At that time, Nanda Baba told, who has bandit? Krishna told, and breathing very long, long, that Maya has tightened me. Oh, mother, he became at once some furious grave. Mother, he so yeah, cruel. cruel cruel hearted, she was not, never like this. Oh, I will punish her. I will punish her like this, then Krishna catch hold his, catch hold his hand. Oh. You know? oh, who untied your rope? You. Who has given let to you? <laughs> you. And who untied your rope? You. Who, who has bended you? Then Krishna, weeping, Mother, you should not go to Mother. Always be with me. Yes? Yes. Then he took Krishna and Baldev, both in his shoulders, shoulders, shoulders. and went to Brahmandagar. He took bath. It became afternoon. afternoon and very mm, nearer to sunset. sunset. Krishna went to his house, but today nothing was cooked. Yasoda was like a statue, she has no sense. And Rani Maya was also gone to anywhere and now he has returned. And she saw and she was, she wanted to pacify Yasoda and Nanda Baba also and to everything. What? Regular, regularize all these things. So there was no cooking, no preparation, nothing. So Nanda Baba came and he took Krishna and Baldev to cows and he milked cows in the <laughs> mouth of Krishna. <laughs> eh? And happily that stomach was fulfilled. And he gave misery, misery sugar, sugar, candy. Sugar, sugar candy in their mouths. Now they are satisfied. He took nothing. In the evening, he was sitting there hmm, with Krishna and Balde, Rohini Maya, and the wife of uh, Upananda, and all the older and senior ladies, like mothers, were there. They came to Nanda Baba and Krishna, taking Balde with them, and they told Balde that pull on Krishna. And take it with us 
and we will give Krishna in the lap of Jasoda. Otherwise, Jasoda, in a moment, he will die. So, Baldev wanted to pull Krishna, and he went, and he catch hold of Krishna. But Krishna was so much now strong, strong that he Baldev he did something, and Baldev Prabhu what pushed away. Pushed away. Then Baldev was saying, "Oh, he is so much stronger than me." <laughs> Then again, uh, Upananda wife and Rani Maya came to Krishna and told, I, "We want that you should come with us and come to Jasoda Maya." He told, "I will not go. Where you will be? In the lap of my father, who will give you something to eat." My father will give. With whom you will sleep? I will sleep with my father. Or to whom you will play with Baldev Dau Bhaiya? Will you not go? Never. Then Rani Bhaiya told, "Oh, if Jasoda Bhaiya dies, dies, then what? And Krishna, when saw that, if my mother will die." Then he beat him, weep again, mother, mother, and did hands like this, mother, 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 mother. Nandava began to weep, all the mothers began to weep, Baldev also began to weep, and he went easily in the lap of Rohini Maya, and Rohini Maya weeping took Krishna, where Jasoda Maya now was like it. Life flesh like wood, and he gave. She gave in the lap of Jasoda Maya. Now Jasoda Maya, having Krishna in her lap, he began to weep so loudly, so loudly, like cows uh, for their calves. After some time, some subsided. Then Rohini Maya at once. Prepared everything, not everything, but in a very short, short, time. short time. Thing. in a brief, brief something, something, and then Nand Baba was called. Nand Baba came. He took Krishna and Baldev in his lap, in his lap, and he began to give first in Baldev Prabhu mouth. <coughs> Krishna was in his left, and Baldev Prabhu was in right. Taking them, and from right hand, something taking to Baldev, something to Krishna, and some. After when they were satisfied, he took something, and he kept knowingly some remnant. For whom? Yasoda. Yasoda. Yasoda was weeping bitterly. Now, when she was not taking, all were requesting Yasoda to take. Some remnant, but she was not taking. Then Nand Baba told to yes. Krishna and Baldev, "Go at once and pull up your mother and bring him here." Yes. Then Krishna went there and Baldev also, and weeping mother Jasoda, they were dragging, pulling Jasoda Maya by her hair, well, and quickly she had to come, and then. She again gave something in the mouth of Krishna and Baldev. Then Nand Baba went outside, and then Jasoda taking some remnant after satisfying Krishna and Baldev. So this muscle rush was renewed by in this way. So Krishna sometimes make problems to renew their. Love and affection. This is past times of Krishna. If anyone remember these past times, Krishna will come with his whole power, with all power in the devotee's heart, and quickly he will remember all the anats, and prema bhakti will come easily. And we should learn something from this so that. That only practice, only do, not do. The mercy should be there. Mercy of Krishna, mercy of 
or mercy of devotees. These mercies are of, of also two kinds. The mercy of Krishna and mercy of devotees. What is the mercy? Oh, Krishna will tell that you have prema bhakti. Or he will make you qualified arranging that you have taste in chanting name, in doing devotional services. How? I will give example tomorrow in my class. You should be satisfied. <laughs> Gaur Prama. Otherwise my doctor is going so. So uh, Agni Sharma. <laughs> now you will have to translate. Donc la Shoda Vija Krishna au mortier est retournée comme font les enfants en sont encore d'un autre. Et après ils ont vu des traces de, de larmes dans les yeux de Krishna. Et Krishna leur a montré qu'en fait, il leur a dit, mais en fait je faisais juste semblant pour pas qu'elle me fasse plus de, de, de punition. Et ils ont commencé à plaisanter et ils ont demandé. Et je vais vous dire dans ma next class. Votre nom Divya Gyan. 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 Divya Gyan.
I want to help anyone. Maras, tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Oh. No, 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 Mara. No, 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 Mara. Last year, you see, last year they have asked him, can we invite Naran Maharaj to your place? They have a place nearby. So they requested him and he said, yes, naturally. But then when he was in America, he wanted to invite you to be high in San Francisco. But as soon as he said that, no, the, the, the word came out and then he started to have phone call from GBC and people, if you do that, we will cut your uh, funds because he's in charge of BI and BI is the finance come from his car. Uh, so when he came this time, he told me, I want, you know, I am very good friend with Maharaj. I have so much respect for him. But if I invite him to my place here, then my service to Prabhupada will be jeopardized, will be in, in, uh, in danger. So there, I, have, I am in very good terms with Maharaj. I have so much honor and respect for him. But this time I think Iskon is not ready to see me doing that. So they were very much, you know, they, the reason why you came actually in the South, because they were thinking to invite you to their place. It should, this festival was supposed to be in their place. Yeah. But then last minute he said, actually this time I cannot receive Maharaj. So they felt very bad because they have so much respect and appreciation for you. So he was himself pushing so much, please, please let him come, let Nara Maharaj come. <laughs> and for now he's feeling very sorry. And he says, oh Guru, I said that you are such a great Vaishnava and we are so much with our heart with you. He's feeling a little you know, despondent because of that. I want to Shri say... Maharaj, sorry, he said to me, I will invite Nara Maharaj to my place myself. I'm, uh, I'm going to tell you frankly that I have no malice for anyone. Especially I have so much honor and so much Please. having uh, friendship to all escorts devotees who are favorable or not favorable. I want to help by my heart. So, if you are not uh, able, uh, able, able, able to invite, but I know your, I, your heart, I'm so much happy. I don't want to create any kind of problem, problem to anyone. So, so many wants to meet me and to associate me, but they are checked. Checking. Prohibited. No harm. No harm. One day they will realize that Narayan Maharaj is our best friend. One day. Yeah. Even protecting and saving and supporting is gone. Even. <laughs> Otherwise, more and more devotees will give up is gone and they will go to their home, giving up everything. everything. But now, by my association, they are realizing something and they are coming again towards Sila Bhakti Siddhanta Sami Prabhupada. So I I am always in favor to support and to help all. And even there who are against me, I don't become any problem. No feeling, feeling no problem. My only problem, my problem, how to help you and help myself to meet Krishna. Only this, nothing else. No if anyone invite, I will surely go there. I don't see any problem. I never care for anyone. Maharaj dit que, en ce qui me concerne, il est ami avec Shripada Udhasami Maharaj. Ils sont très amis.
And after that, oh, you should tell me. Don't. You should remember Pekitan. And with mood, you should do Pekitan. Bring them. And if you are reading book, and then you will have no meditation at that time to Krishna. Or the meaning of that song. Thank you. 
You could come here. Abhyanat Mirandhasya Dhyananjana Salakaya Chakshurun Militangjina Tasmai Shri Gurave Vancha Kalpatarubhasya Kripa Sindhu Bhaivacha Patitanam Pamele Vaishnavet Namo Mahabadanaya Krishna Prema Pradayate Krishnaya Krishna Chaitanyanam Gauratvise Gurave Gaurachandraya Radhikaya Tadalaya Krishnaya Krishna Bhaktaya Tadabhaktayana Yang Prabhrajantamanupetamapet Krityam Dvaipāyano virahaka tarayāju hāva Putre titan maitaya tarvo vinedu Tan sarvabhu taridayam munimāna tosmi Tavai vāsmi tavai vāsmi na jivāmi tvayābina Iti pikhyāya rādhe pavanā पते छंद ते ज्ञान ज्ञान न तत्व दर्शना इटकी इस लोक पर शिष्य में बंद कम पड़ता है पते जो पते छंद ते ज्ञान ज्ञान न तत्व समाद गुरु तो समाद गुरु तो पद्धि तत्त्व 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 � Jnanina Tattva Darshinaha Krishna This should be taken some far away there Tar Choti Maharaj Kya Jani Tata hai Tar Choti Maharaj Upar me le jasa Ah yes Anyway that should be Hey, 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 yeah, somehow. Not yet. Going there. Uh, yeah. No. <laughs> there is much difference in uh, Pariprasna and doubt. Doubt means something Offensive. Hmm. Arjun has no doubt to Krishna that he is supreme personality of Godhead or not. And knowing anything or not. Nothing he has doubt. Whether Krishna has any Guru Parampara or not. Hmm. Has Krishna any Guru Parampara? Krishna, any Guru Parampara? But he is telling that I am Guru of Guru of main Guru. And lakhs and lakhs years before, I told it to Shan, Vishaswan. 
So Krishna is your guru. Why should I admit? Who gave him this knowledge or mantra? Then doubt will come. Arjun has no doubt. If you want to know the meaning of Gita and teachings, you should be like Arjun. He gave himself in the lotus feet of Krishna. What he will tell, I will obey. But I have some pariprasna. What is pariprasna? With honor to Gurudev. And he wants to know something. He cannot uh, adjust or understand by his intelligence. And he cannot reconcile. So he is asking, praying that Krishna, I will follow you. And he, what is not understanding? He is questioning, questioning, again questioning. Up to 18th chapter. Always question and question. Never any doubt. So we should be in that line. No doubt. Doubt should be gone before taking initiation. You should test, we should doubt, we should all this before taking initiation to Gurudev. Don't have any doubt towards Krishna. Why he took all the clothes of gopis? Why? And he why wanted to see them naked. Why Krishna being so supreme and he collected so many gopis, wives of another gopis, and he did rush? Why? <laughs> All these bad things? These are doubts. Never. Arjun, never ask. No doubt about Krishna. That Krishna is supreme personality of God. Why? And he is about of all kinds of knowledge. So we should be like that. So we should have some uh, Gyan. Knowledge. No. Knowledge. No. Knowledge. No. Knowledge. Discrimination about all these things. So, when you will uh, know all these things, then you may be like Madhya Madhikari. Then, no doubt. Madhya Madhikari, no doubt. So, we should associate with the persons, those who are Madhya Madhikari. And they can help us having no doubt. They maybe have some pariprasna and they will put it to another, his superiors. We have some also doubts, no, uh, no <coughs> doubts. We have some pariprasna. But we are unlucky. I am unlucky that uh, now I am not uh, having Answer. answered. Answer. But I know. Sometime that my Guru Dev is present. <coughs> All the devotees who are perfect in Krishna Prem, all are present. They never die. Never. So if you will pray, sometimes I pray and I see that all my questions are solved at once, quickly. So you should be like that. Those who think that Srila Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Thakur never took sannyas from his Guru Deva or anyone he took himself. They don't know that his Guru never dies. Never. Gorkusha Sarva did at that time. He was there present and he took sannyas from him. No doubt. If any conditioned soul does not die, only change the cloth, this, then they 
persons so much uh, having realization and we think that prabhupad was not of this world he was from golok bindavan dait das he was very near and dear to shrimati radhika known as nayan manjari so he is not like general person he was not conditioned soul so we should not have any doubt narudrishi here i told to my yesterday about narudrishi when he met with nalkobar and mani grave playing in the pond with so many girls naked and what is thinking have you that book i took it i told told you yes. to bring i took but i want to do some singing est-ce qu'il y a un dixième chant là-bas sur la table un livre uh. bleu mais ici oh here here okay i knew i put it somewhere Which, which he told. Oh, tenth, tenth, tenth. And shloka. Clock nine, eight, nine, and begin from eight nine. No han no, jusho to joshyan, but the wrong soul was joguna. Shimad, ad abhijatyaadi jatra stri dutam arshava. धन्यते पशु जत्र निर्दय अजितात्म मनमाने इमं देहम अजरा मृत्यु नश्वर वट इज टेलिंग रेड द मीनिंग बाय स्वामी जी नारायणीजर taking birth in our sacred family and being learned when one is uneducated but falsely perfected by wealth the result is that one engages his wealth in enjoying wine women and gambling among the three hannate pa hannate pa shu after that and i go to there is purport also ha ata you should read it will help purport by shri prabhupad among the three modes of material nature goodness passion and ignorance people are certainly conducted by the lower qualities namely passion and ignorance and especially by passion conducted by the mode of passion one becomes more and more involved in material existence therefore human life is meant for subduing the modes of passion and ignorance and advancing the mode of goodness tada raja stamo bhava kamalo badayas chali chita etir anavidam svam sarve prasidati this is culture one must subdue the mode of passion and ignorance in the mode of passion when one is forced to the plot of wealth one engages his wealth only for three things namely wine women and gambling we can actually see especially in this age that those who have unnecessary riches simply try to enjoy these three things in western civilization these three things are very prominent because of an unnecessary increase of wealth now that we consider all this in the case of manigriva and alakuba because they found in them so much pride in the words of their father kuba anante pashavo yatra yeah hanyate hanyante pashavo yatra those who kill animals birds or all others being so much cruel they think that my this body is eternal i'll never be i or any telk of suffering will not come to me they think no nardrish is asking them <coughs> that deha kim anudata this body is belongs to whom this is mine are those who are supporting father and mother are those who are giving 
uh, Anna. Friends, 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 and and supports us. Are the king in which in, where in that kingdom, kingdom we are? Are it is belongs to this body belongs to my father or mother? Are they are father mother? Are those who met have made them uh, servant? And pay something today. <laughs> Are those who have conquered this body, like when Napoleon was conquered by uh, all others, Mithras and a friend army, and he was conquered and he was put to death. Or when we die, it is given to fire or earth. So this is. This belongs to fire or earth, eh? or so many dogs and eagles, jackals, eh? jackals. jackals, also eagle, they quarrel for this body that I will eat, I will eat, and they quarrel each other for that body. They belongs to this body, or. Who is the master of this body? You can read this again. Deham kiman not anudatu. While alive, does this body belong to its employer, to the self, the father, the mother, or the mother's father? Does it belong to the person who takes it away by force, to the slave master who purchases it, or to the sons who burn it in the fire? Or if the body is not burned, does it belong to the dogs that eat it? <coughs> Among the many possible claimants, who is the rightful claimant? Not to ascertain this, but instead <coughs> to maintain the body by sinful activities is not good. Why we should quarrel for this? Always try to use this body for all these things. This body is not for doubts or all other things for toxications and all these things. Our body is soul there, and we are eternal servant by that to Krishna. Now they are not realizing this. Who? The sons of Kuvay, Nal Kubar, and Manikri. If there is poverty, it is like a medicine. Then he will not be angry so much, and if he will angry, then anyone can give a slap to him. So he should tolerate. So by poorness, tolerance comes automatically. And if you are not tolerant, then all will give you punches. Punch punch so I should make him so poor. <laughs> <coughs> Anyone does not know that if you are punching him. Punching him, okay? Yes. No, no. Pinching. Pinch by any uh, by a knife or anything. Pricking. Pricked. Pinching. Then he will have surely some feeling. But this needs to these persons who kill animals. If anyone cut their he hand. <laughs> From here, from here, then they will realize this pain. <coughs> Otherwise, not. So I will make this two persons like this. They should realize all these things. They should be very poor. They should be like tree that they should stand up in ho about a thousand. thousand and thousand years. Anyone cut their hands and then they will drop. But at that time, they cannot do. They ta cannot take revenge. In this, in this stage, they can take revenge, anyone. But at that time, they were not to power, not power to revenge anyone. Okay. So, daridro nirhang kar stambho mukta sarva idam eiriha krishamjad drichya aproti 
तद्धी तस्य परम तपः so if guru is chastising and guru is high class of vaishnav self realized and if he chastising then you saw that it is like blessing and medicine you should not do anything opposed to oppose or anything and think that guru is now against me like now we days sometimes think that oh my guru dev is so much <laughs> against me <coughs> so never you should think you should think like medicine so the uh, anger the sharp curse curse, curse and <coughs> benediction benediction both are one no difference at all he is going to give curse but how he is thinking how i can make him so lucky and fortunate to realize all these things a guru like things like this you know the example of chaitanya mahaprabhu and choto haridas chaitanya mahaprabhu told him don't come to me i wa- never want to see your mouth face and he was restricted not to come there at last he has to go to triveni par gang anjam namits and he left his body chetan mahaprabhu was satisfied he know that he will not die but his soul will be come and terrified and choto hari das thakur has not done any offense so much but to show example by his own associates associates he had done like this <coughs> so we should have so much um, instruction from all these things so tamo madam harishyami स्त्रो अजितात्मनो नैंटेन्य श्लोक तदहम मतोर्मा वरुणया श्रीमदाधयो तमो मदम हरिष्या स्त्रो अजितात्मन I've been blinded by the pride of celestial opulence, and I've become attached to women. I shall relieve them of their false prestige. So now we are like in this stage, Kanishta Dikari. Though we have taken some of us initiation, but that initiation is not of high class of initiation. Be the duri. So we must follow all these things. If being a devotee, you have lost so much. Not love and affection for Krishna. Not love, love and affection for your Guru Dev. And for toxication or other other thing, that it is not good. We should try to reform us by this hearing all these things. So this Hari Katha is so powerful. For all stages of sadhus, devotee, all. So we should try to realize all these things and to follow very strictly. Jati mau loka palasya putro bhutva tamapluto na vivasvasa atmanam bijanita sumdurmato ato arhata. स्थावरत्ता श्यातांग नैव जता पुनः 
दिव्य सर्सते वृत्ते स्वर्लोक भो लब्ध भक्ति भविष्य and after that krishna will touch him, them and by that krishna will make them to go to with him to golok vrindavan what became when krishna touched them not with his own body transcendental body but some power came from rope to, and from rope to short vrindal motor and gretel motor was yamla yamla and at once quickly some power came in them and they broke down with very great sound sound sound, sound. sound. and both came from the tree very good very beautiful shape like god semi god semi god and they began to pray and this Done parikra. They do did parikrama to Krishna four times, and they no. fell fell down on the uh, on the earth <coughs> like dandot pranam, and then stand up and they were praying to Krishna. What praying? Bani gunan gunanu kathane. Sanaun 